Disclaimer, this product was provided to the author to do a review. All opinions are 100% authors and authors alone. For more information, visit bit.ly slash dbdisclose. Hello my friends, this is Iggy back again with Dragon Blogger. So I am playing Overwatch right now at 4K. And you can see just how great the game is performing. Nice. Ah, oh, and they got me. Uh, again. Playing Overwatch at 4K. I'm playing right now on the Sapphire Radeon Pulse. RX 570 ITX or mini card, issue. they might call it. This card is not a full 11 inch card or something. It's uh, 6.69 inches, very tiny. And you might think, hey, you know, it's not that powerful, but it packs a punch. Again, you can see I'm in the 60s. I will hit 70s at times. And she is playing beautiful. Ah. And anyway, while I'm dead, let me go ahead. It's been a while since I've played. Let me go ahead and show you the settings I'm at. 3840 by 2160. And we'll go to advanced. You can see mostly on high. We must not two falter. on ultra. One on medium. So she's playing perfect. We have to stop them. So let's go ahead and get back in the game. I don't want to let my team down. Oh no. Defense point. Objective B. All right, so let's see if we can, uh... My spirit is strong. No one can hide from my sight. So, again, you can see the awesome frame rates at the very high settings. This card is a champ. Overconfidence is a flimsy shield. Well, it just needs to improve my gaming. But again, it's been a while since I played this one. Ah, uh, and we were defeated. Anyway, Iggy with Dragon Blogger again. Showing you the performance of the Sapphire Radeon Pulse RX 570 Mini or ITX. Iggy with Dragon Blogger out. See you guys. Disclaimer This product was provided to the author to do a review. All opinions are 100% authors and authors alone. For more information, visit bit.ly slash dbdisclose. To have your product or brand showcased on Dragon Blogger, visit bit.ly slash review my product. Thank you for watching.